Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can delete a recurring or a repeating calendar event on iPhone 11 or the 11 Pro running iOS 13. Now, first, let's go back to your home screen and launch the calendar event. In here, you can see that I have a repeating calendar event on the 7th, 14th, 21st, 28th. So if I go into today, you can see here if I have on the 22nd, I think on the 20, so I'm, let's go back into this view, so 21st, so if you go into the 21st, you can see I have a calendar meeting event. If I go into the 28th, I also have another um, calendar meeting event. Now, when deleting event, you have two options. You can say I can delete this event only or delete all future events. Sometimes it is a good idea to keep the previous event for a record, but you only want to delete uh, the, the, any event uh, from today onwards. So to do so, what you want to do is go to your calendar. So go to the month calendar. And from the, month, um, from the monthly calendar, what you want to do is select on the date that you want to delete going forward. So let's say I want to keep all my um, team meetings event in the past, but I want to start deleting it from the 28th of January going forward. So I'm going to select on that one, then select on the recurrent calendar event, then tap on delete event, and then tap on delete all future events or this event only. So let's choose delete all future events. And then you can see if I go back to the month, on it from the 28th going forward, it has been deleted. So that is something different. So you can see now it's all gone. All this event here is um, something else. So the team meetings event is gone, but any event prior to that is still, is still uh, remain in the calendar. So 21st, I still got a team meeting. And on the 14th, I still got a team meeting there. So that's how you can delete um, a calendar event. Uh, we can kind of events, uh, whether it's the whole series or just from the one on the current date going forward. Uh, you can delete a single re recurrent event. So let's say this one here, I can delete this one. So tap on that and then tap on delete event and then choose delete this event only. So that is only deleting a single repeating event. So I go back here, you can see that one is gone, but the one on the 21st, uh, on the 21st is still there. And that's it. So that's how you can delete a repeating or recurring event on your iPhone calendar. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.